Welcome back to the fourth installment of the Tan Talk series, a collection of videos made by Tanner Crawford and Julian Landis. Spring break is coming up in the next couple weeks, so you have plenty of time to do more service since you have so much more free time. Today we will be talking about two local opportunities and one online one. I hope that you enjoy. Jackson Township needs your help for the community Easter egg hunt. This event is spearheaded by the township and all volunteers would be greatly appreciated. The volunteer opportunities are as follows. Now until the 18th of March, you can help collect donations for the Easter eggs. From the 21st to the 28th, you can also help fill the Easter eggs. Or on the 9th of April, you can attend and help at the Easter egg hunt. If you are at all interested, please contact Shailee's head at the above locations or Sophia Minor, a JHS junior, at her email. Next, we move on to a project of one of our own JAG seniors, Sam Wilk. Hey, donate to Bear Hugs Technology Drive from now until May 3rd. We'll take any old device, phones, tablets, etc. Donations will be accepted at your history or American government teacher. Remember, each device donated is two service hours. Thank you. Sam would really appreciate it if you donated your unused old technology for a better cause. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to him over email. This brings us to the second segment of the video. Are you looking for service opportunities that work with your schedule? Then volunteering through the Library of Congress might be for you. Being an online service opportunity, it is a perfect task to easily acquire service hours while keeping on your own time. The Library of Congress needs help transcribing and reviewing transcriptions of historical documents. Their current campaign consists of the William A. Gladstone Afro-American Military Collection, which spans the years 1773 to 1987, with the bulk of the material dating from the Civil War period. This collection documents African Americans in military service, especially the United States Corps d'Afrique and the United States Colored Troops, which were organized during the Civil War. The collection consists of correspondence, pay vouchers, orders, muster rolls, enlistment and discharge papers, receipts, contracts, affidavits, tax records, miscellaneous military documents, and printed matter. Also included are many documents concerning slavery and various other Civil War documents that mention African Americans. Printed matter includes 19th century speeches and writings on slavery, government orders, broadsides, 20th century booklets, and journal articles for scholars or collectors. So as you can see, there's a lot of work to be done. Because of potentially offensive and racist language and views, which reflect both their time and circumstances, this transcription project may not be suitable for all volunteers. All interested, go to the website on the screen and sign up today. Oh, I didn't see you there! Thank you so much for staying till the end of the video. In fact, for that, I will give you your very first Tan Talk coupon that is valid for a free video next week. But seriously, thank you so much to all the people who have supplied me with service opportunities to talk about, and to my partner Julian Landis for researching them. I will see you all next week.